It's wonderful to be here and wonderful to have you here with us. Oh, thank you for having me. Chief Transformation Officer. Transformation being the kind of operative word there. Change is, to build on just what we were talking about, change is something that, you know, gets any number of reactions. It's mm -hmm. kind of what propels this whole industry, but also sometimes organizations can be averse to change. How do you find that? How do you manage that across your organization? And what does that, what does that really mean to you? Uh, I think change is necessary for progress. And so without change, we're all be staying still, you know? So um, there's a lot of opportunity in change. Uh, those who, the apprehension that we've seen in the industry and where that's coming from tends to be largely due to a lack of understanding, right? And I think as we try and grow understanding, we can grow people's appetite for change and how that can help drive us as an industry forward, drive our clients forward, and drive our agency capabilities and offerings forward. What are some areas that you can tell need to change or need to embrace change and you really want to see that change start to accelerate? I guess given the nature of my role, um, technology, data, um, and how we use that to create connections for consumers and grow business is an area that needs um, a lot of change. And it's whether we like it or not, it's already underway. You know, with regulation changes, with technology developments, with, you know, what Web3, what's mm -hmm. Web3 and what does that mean for people? You know, there's um, waves of change that are coming along and it's, um, I think, an opportunity to propel ourselves forward or catch yourself falling behind. What do you think it'll be that we're talking about, whether it's next year at can or three years from now at can? What are some of the things that you think will be kind of driving the conversation? Mm. I think in all contexts, identity is one of the things that will get um, a continued evolution of discussion as we go forward. Whether we're talking about digital identities, consumer identities, identity management, how do you know who your consumers are? How do you understand what they're interested in? How do you engage, you know, measure, understand what that looks like? But also the way we um, think about brand identity, we think about, you know, individual's identity and self-expression. So I think the concept of identity is one that's really rich and we are only starting to really peel back the onion in terms of understanding, I guess, the implications of that going forward. How would you complete this sentence? A, a, a campaign without a really powerful insight a uh, campaign without a powerful insight is like music without rhythm. You know, it's just noise. There's no focus, there's no direction. And if it sounds good, you've got real lucky, right? But in most cases, it'll be um, empty and aimless and maybe won't achieve that objective that you had when you kicked off. <laughs>